Hi, I'm Bill Hackett and welcome to The Boat Show. And today we're at Prestige and we're talking about the X-Line with its designer, Camila Garoni. Good morning. It's a pleasure for me being here and being able to tell you everything about this new range of Prestige called X-Line. So what was the inspiration for the X-Line? Con la gamma X-Line abbiamo voluto uh, creare un nuovo mondo, un nuovo modo di vivere uh, il mare. With the range X-Line, we wanted to create a new way of living the sea. With the X-Range, Prestige created yachts to live the sea, so we have completely changed our approach. There are some huge cockpits as well as huge interior spaces that are always connected indoor-outdoor to create a kind of porch between the cockpit and the interior. It's a very convivial common space that is present both in the first X70 and the new X60, which is the second yacht. Fantastic. So was there some challenges with the X70 as one size and the X60 is a little smaller? Nella prima, nella X70, il concetto è stato portato al massimo per cercare di spingere il più possibile tutti quelli che sono i concetti della vita a bordo. Sulla X70 abbiamo una barca che completamente... In the first one, the X70, the concept has been brought to the maximum to try to nudge as far as possible all the concepts of life on board. The X70 is a completely wide-body yacht. We used all the space in the width of the yacht to create a new living volume with a completely different flow. On the X60, which is a little smaller yacht, we kept a passageway to easily reach the bow, but we removed the one on the starboard side to maintain this volume concept that is common to the two yachts. Comunque mantenere questo concetto di spazio di volume comune alle due barche. Amazing job getting all that concept into this small space, but what do we have for the future? Sicuramente la gamma X-Line per Prestige è molto importante perché andiamo a ricercare e a trovare... Certainly, the X-Line range for Prestige is very important because we are going to research and find a new type of customer. A type of customer who is not in a hurry but wants to experience the yacht in a different way, with different spaces and different finishes. Certainly, there are some differences between the Prestige Fly, the Prestige X and the new Prestige M which are the multi-hulls. Each of these ranges, and specifically the X range and the X60, are a step forward in terms of materials, finishes, and interior spaces. Fantastic, I think it's lovely. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a closer look at this X60 right now. So when you own a boat, it's all about getting in the water. And how do you do that? Right back here on the uh, swim platform. First of all, it articulates down and you can get in and out of the water as you wish. You can put your feet in the water and have a drink all day long. When you come out of the water, you can have a fresh water wash down shower and then you can sit in here. This is called the beach club. So the beach club flips up and flips down with the press of a button. And what you find underneath is your fusion stereo get all the music going, good vibes, get a drink, and everything is going well. Hey, maybe you want to take the uh, sea bob for a spin? Guess what? A little cabin tree for it right there. And then just behind me, we have crew quarters, so anybody else can take the wheel and you can relax. The X-Line concept is all about being in contact with everybody and the sea, and it happens right here. This is what we call the infinity cockpit. So we have glass here, easy access on either side to get up or down, but the most important thing is we have contact with everybody inside the salon and into the galley, and we have contact down below to the swim platform and the beach club. Out here it's bright and airy, we have sunshade while under rest, and of course we have a beautiful dinette, totally modular, you can move things around. Also we have an aft docking station so the X60's DNA is right here in the main salon. What you're gonna notice is we have a, a center galley split onto both sides and that allows us the maximum amount of space into the cabin. And what that does for all our guests is allows us to communicate, whether it be from the galley into the salon, or we can continue that out to the infinity platform so everybody can have a good time and remain on one level and keep the conversation going. The reflection of 
the water. So we have French design furniture in here and although it's absolutely stunningly beautiful, it's also very tactile. There's a sense of feeling in here. When you touch the wood grain, it's super smooth, buttery soft. And then we have fabrics like silk and satins in here, and it really adds value to the overall experience. Carrying on with that X-Line tradition is that inverted helm windshield. Gives great visibility and it maximizes space on the interior. We also have a companion sofa for your guests to chat at the captain, or maybe you're gonna be an owner operator. This is a crossover yacht. As we pay attention to the helm itself here, we have twin Garmin displays, so you have all your charts and data right at hand. Let's check out the performance of this beauty. It's tricked out with twin Cummins 600 horsepower Zeus engines, and it's gonna push her about 25 miles an hour, cruise right around 20, and you get a range of about 226 nautical miles. It also has a joystick, and it has a bow thruster. So if you need protection from the weather, or better yet, you want to let that breeze in, we have three points to get in and out. First up by the helm, there's a slider up to the bow that way. In the back, we have a triple sliding glass door with access to the infinity cockpit. And right here, we have a bay slider, which gives you access to the side deck up to the bow. Now, right here, plenty of safety right up here, lighting as you go, very wide. As a matter of fact, it's time to check out the bow. Up here in the bow, you can catch all those rays. Look at how comfortable it is up here. So relaxing, you're ready for the evening. We have pop-up lights and a nice little table. Here we are in this full beam master. What a delight, great lighting in here. As we move forward, we have a full walk-in closet and then there's a walk-through shower right between the closet and the full ensuite and a separate head. In the forward part of the boat, we have two other guest cabins. One is a twin and one is a double. And then they also have a shared day head. So this X60 has an overall length of 62 feet. It's got a 16 foot beam and up here on the flybridge, we get full beam up here. That's 16 feet, that's 280 square feet of entertaining space. Chaise lounge, dining area, summer kitchen. And as we move forward, we have a duplicate helm, a nice sofa settee, very stylish. This boat has everything you need and more.